an open letter to the world. Letter concerning those above us especially meant to be read by them. Power to the people. I am a 32-year-old resident of our planet, living in the Emmental. This is currently in something like the Shire of Switzerland, wishing beautiful green hills. The world seems to stand still, nice and peaceful. But then I followed throughout all week to what's going out there in the world. I cannot sleep anymore thinking about all this chaos a lot. Although I know my English is very bad, I do hope you'll understand what I have to say. I must write this letter and hope to find a little peace for myself. And, who knows, for the world, the truth must become judge and executioner of the ruling. It cannot continue like that anymore. It must be, now, global revolution. Now it's the time. If one person is killed it is murder. Killing 1000.000 it's called foreign politics. Statesmen are the real terrorists. They and the bosses, the super rich of this world do think the world rests in their bloody hands. Lying to us for over 2000 years to suppress us the common people, the poor, the workers. I know the rulers of this world are the real terrorists. They have in fact orchestrated 9 over 11 just to scare us, to have another reason for war. War against so-called terrorists. Where has the real terrorists live a good life in the White House and govern the world? There is a death outside in the world. Thousands of children die every day from the effects of globalization although there would be enough good for everybody. I know you are mastering the media. This dominates many areas of life. You are deliberately destroying our world. I wonder why. Are we too many in this world? Is this reducing people? Is this the answer? Is it this you want? A selection of people? Small elite shall live and the rest shall die. Is this also why you are inventing new diseases? Why? Is it a money question? To me it does fucking shit not matter what politicians talk about. I want the truth, and only the truth. Will I ever get it? Why are you lying to us about all the wars that you are leading in the name of democracy? Resources, like for example oil, is your motivation. You want to get all the money those resources will be achieved, for yourself. And then when you live alone in this world, will you be killing the ones like you because they too want this money? I want to know why you use arms containing uranium. Still every day children die of those weapons. Damn, I do not need a flag that tells me who I am what I have to do. You are contaminating water in the name of the industry. What we eat makes us sick. Why? Because you want to decimate the human race specifically. Because you know that the planet cannot continue like that and will die. You seem to forget that you will die too then. You let circulate images of 10000 of thousands of plastic coffins in the world on the internet. Why producing aluminium in Iceland by a major corporation? which will be later on used as weapons. On the other hand you're building a dam which then will destroy this lovely island. I'd have thousands of examples of these things going on and therefore those of questions to answer. I'm not born to function for a state or a country that enslaves me. I here to find out more about myself, called self-awareness. I believe it is just that you do not want, you do not want people thinking about themselves. You have, so far, been very skillfully by, for example, various campaigns, manipulation of people, especially those not belonging to the chosen people enslaves themselves by watching television thinking they are deciding out of themselves what to watch, whereas it is you making them watch what you want them to watch. We work like mad, can afford holidays, homes, cars, so that makes us feel important. In fact we are your slave and don't even realize it, sad but true that one is much more a product of your doing. I hope, wish, this movement may become the most upfront change the world has ever seen. Like an extensive blaze for justice, to give power to the people. We are the people. You can only exist because of us in the end. What will you do without our handicraft? You are just nothing in the end. Only one thing has to be done by us, make people understand their force to change the world. One day we will achieve. Be sure of that strikes to begin with our one weapon in our hands. What will you do when nobody goes back to work? Even the biggest companies then will have to close down. There is only one world. We, the people, have to see that this world will remain healthy. A good world. It will, with our hands, through us. Not by you.
You who think you are gods. No you are evil and we have started to realize this just now. Thanks to for the inspiration. He gave us the courage to stand again.